Hi guys, hope you're all well. If you're new to Siege Studios, we're a premium miniature painting service with over 30 artists. Here at Siege we offer four painting levels, ranging from our bronze, premium gaming quality, up to our platinum competition standard. For your free quote today, follow the link in the description of this video. Hey guys, hope you're all well and welcome to this showcase video. Today we've got a custom scheme Necron Force for you all to check out. Uh, this has been completed by Mick, one of the artists here at Siege. Um, really, really nice cream, red and green colourway. We've also obviously got the uh, Nightbringer there as one of the characters in the Force just to throw in sort of a bit more of a grim kind of feel to the uh, to the project and to the Force, but really, really nice use of colours across them. Three characters here, we've got a Lord, obviously a Cryptek, and then we've also got the, um, the Nightbringer. So let's jump in and have a look at these uh, models uh, in all their really dark majesty. Uh, again, a really nice use of colour on this miniature, obviously with this bone colour that's been done. You've got this red sort of brush blended uh, sort of weapon that's been done on here. Uh, obviously you've got the resurrection orb in his hand that's glowing. Uh, we've got these all really cool kind of uh, Blackstone Fortress but alternate colourway kind of uh, painting scheme just on these. Uh, and again, you've got that really cool sort of porcelain kind of cream kind of bone armour, which is just awesome. Uh, do love the use of the green and blue hues on the basing and also on various areas areas of the miniatures just to obviously contrast with the red that's been painted on for the gems orbs and sort of little energy glow areas as well which is really really cool so that's just this lord uh, we'll jump across and have a look at the cryptech uh, do really really love this model I've always love this cryptech models kind of surfing on that uh that necron construct which is just awesome uh and again you can see that lovely brush blended sort of uh sort of scythe or weapon that he's got there mixed done a great job on that got obviously all these uh sort of glowing effects here on the various orbs and spheres that are just on his armor and, and uh on this uh his friendly little friend here uh again you've got this really cool kind of uh sort of cape here steel cape but all the edging done there really sharply and nicely highlighted again absolutely love what mixed done with these bases uh, it's kind of like I said an alternate take on uh, the Blackstone Fortress basing which is just really cool I love the fact that where the uh, sort of points cross you've got this brightening effect which kind of obviously gives like a the feel or vibe of energy sort of flowing through these uh, sort of avenues on the ba on the basing which is really really cool uh, again just an awesome awesome model to lead any Necron force and then we have the most sinister man in, in the galaxy or sinister creature in the galaxy we have the Nightbringer uh, and uh, again Mick's done a really awesome job on this miniature uh, uh, very very imposing and evil looking model uh, again just again surfing away there on some scarabs <laughs> but uh, again just really really well executed nice subtle red glow on the eyes as well just to show that evil energy sort of going flowing through him uh, but you can see all the muscular structure of his abdomen and chest and arms all fully painted and highlighted and just uh, blended nicely to add that sort of really cool kind of effect to this uh, this miniature and again you've got that sort of blending just done on the scythe there also uh, but again just a really awesome awesome model to uh, to lead and be part of any Necron force and that is the uh, the Nightbringer and these two other characters uh, that are part of the army do hope that you like them so next we've got some awesome spiders and a annihilation barge to have a look at for this uh, custom scheme Necron force uh, three spiders again really awesome awesome models from uh, games workshop uh, lots of character on them and you can see mixed on a great job of using this really cool uh, sort of uh, bone ivory kind of uh, sort of and steel kind of colorway on them uh, nice sort of uh, bluish black sort of armored areas here with these sort of really cool red energy glows and then we've obviously got these uh, sort of big gems or sort of uh, things on the back of the spider that are also blended with catch lights and things really really well done uh, again you've got that blackstone fortress kind of esque basing just on these with those energy points where they're just like energy throwing through those sort of uh, avenues on the on the base i don't know what to call them really but really really cool scheme that our client sort of has come up with and that we've executed for them uh, but again this awesome spider uh, we'll have a look at the other two spiders just for consistency purposes uh, but again you can see a uh, really really nice execution across all of these these are all magnetized as well so to interchange weapons so there are interchangeable weapons for uh, various different bits and bobs on this uh, project as well uh, so that's just another one of the spiders and then we'll pull forward the tertiary or third one uh, again just really really well done by our sort of mick here he's uh, really taken a lot of time to add all the little details and things onto the miniatures and edge highlight them all fully uh, through multiple stages and add all those little bits and bobs that you'd expect with us here at Siege onto the models but a beautiful set of Necrons in a very cool custom scheme uh, and finally we have a look at the uh, Annihilation Barge again a really cool model uh, from the Necron range uh, the Lord obviously that you saw earlier in the video has come from that uh, but again just really really well executed 
executed. Uh, again, all the edging done across the various areas of armor, weaponry, all the glows done on the various gems or orbs. Uh, do love the use of red here, just on these uh, sort of spheres here to show the energy flowing through there, much like on the basing as well. Uh, again, you've got the orbs here at the front and just a nice pulsating kind of energy just on these coils and things. And then you've got all the buttons and dials done on the command column there, also on the uh, on the sort of uh, annihilation barge also. Uh, but again, really, really well executed and uh, a lovely bit of kit to add to your Necron force. So there we go, guys. We've got some spiders and also annihilation barge. I do hope you like them ever so much. They're now off to expand their dynasty. I'll see you very soon on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye. So thanks for watching the video guys, I hope that you have enjoyed it. While you're here on YouTube, help us out by subscribing to the Siege channel. We upload at least three videos a week, so make sure you hit that bell icon to be notified when a new video is live. To see more, go follow us on our other social media where you can keep up to date with what we get up to and interact with us. If you're looking to learn from us, we offer online tuition on Patreon and physical classes nationally in the UK. Finally, to get your free quote today, click the link in the description of this video. From all the team here at Siege and myself, a massive thank you for watching the video and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.